What is going on guys? It's Sok and I'm back with a brand new video on Super Duper Tech. And in today's video, I'll be unboxing the brand new released Beats X wireless earphones. Now this is just a little heads up that if you guys aren't following me on Instagram, to go ahead and do so, as I did do an unboxing of the white colored Beats X earphones. But without any further ado, let's hit the tiles. Now here is just a little side-by-side -side comparison of what it looks like with the black and the white Beats X earphones. Now on one side of the box you will see that it does say Beats by Dr. Dre and on the other it does say people aren't hearing all the music as well as an autograph by Dr. Dre himself. Now of course as I did do the unboxing of the white Beats X on my Instagram in today's video I will be unboxing the black model. Now if you do take a closer look at the bottom of the box itself you will notice a pull tab and pulling on this does reveal you another tab which will be used to open up the box and pulling on this tab does remove the plastic lid which does reveal the Beats X earphones laying on top. So placing the earphones to the side we do get a closer look at what actually comes included in the box and everything is kept inside one other piece of packaging and the first thing that you do get in this is of course all your documentation and literature and the first of these is a free complimentary three month trial of Apple Music and if you guys are fast enough then you will be able to use that code and next you do get a quick start guide which shows you how to pair these Beatex earphones to your iPhone or other device as well as how to change the ear tips and the wing tips and charge up the earphones themselves you do also get one rather large Beats logo sticker as well as some rather important safety instructions informing you not to use them while you're driving as well as leaving the ear tips around kids and lastly you do get information with regards to your one year limited warranty so what else do you get included in the packaging well first up you do get your ear tips followed up by your wing tips next you do get your beats branded silicon carry case as well as a 20 centimeter beats branded lightning cable to charge up the earbuds themselves so first up, the lightning cable included does feel a lot more thicker and it will last longer, at least when compared to the typical one that you get included with your iPhone. And next up, you do get three different pairs of interchangeable ear tips, which can be changed to match your ear so that you get a perfect fit. And as there is already a pair that comes installed on the Beats X, in fact, you do actually get four pairs in total. Next, you do get two different sized pairs of your wing tips, now when these are connected and installed onto the Beats X, they will allow for a more stable fit, which will mean that they will need a lot more resistance for them to fall out of your ears. And lastly, you do get the rather oddly shaped silicon Beats branded carry case. Now I myself am quite baffled at the overall design of this case. And I myself do find that when inserting these earphones into the case itself, that you do end up tangling them inside the case. In fact, I would have much preferred if Beats did supply us with a little carry pouch instead of this. And finally, we get to the Beats X earphones themselves. As I mentioned earlier, these earphones do come with a set of ear tips already pre-installed. As both of these Beats X earphones are connected using a single wire, on the left-hand side, you do get the lightning charger port which once again will be used to charge up the earphones. Also on the same left hand side you do get the inline volume controls which will be used to increase or decrease the volume. You do also get a play pause button as well as the microphone itself. And the backs of each of the earbuds themselves is magnetic which means when you do have it on your neck and both of the earbuds do touch each other that it will be a lot more harder for the earphones themselves to drop on the floor. Much like the AirPods and the Solo 3 headphones, these Beats X earphones do have the W1 chip, which does make the pairing process a lot more easier as you only have to have the Bluetooth turned on on your iPhone and turn the power on on the earphones themselves. And then all you have to do is tap on connect and then these Beats X wireless earphones will be connected up with all of your devices provided they use the same Apple ID. So guys, that has been it for today's video. I do hope you did enjoy it. If you did enjoy it, then make sure you smack that like button. And if you are new around here, then why not subscribe? Also guys, if you do have any questions or queries, go ahead and leave them down below in the comment section or go ahead and hit me up on my social media for live behind the scenes footage. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.